Midnight Mass is the third miniseries from writer-director Mike Flanagan, who had previously brought us The Haunting of Hill House and The Haunting of Bly Manor. Uh, I was looking forward to this. I didn't know much about this. I seen the trailer once, uh, but I didn't know much about it. Uh, I really enjoyed this. This is a great show. Uh, I just finished it there last night. Uh, some great standout performances from the actors here, and a, and a fantastic script by Mike Flanagan. Uh, hats off to him here. It is really, really engrossing. Uh, returning actors here again, we have Kate Siegel, Henry Thomas from The Haunting of Hill House, and we have Annabeth Gish and Rahul Kohli from The Haunting of Bly Manor. Uh, but we have fantastic standout performances here by Hamish Linklater as Father Paul and Be- or Samantha Slohian, sorry, as Bev Keane. Uh, fan- tour de force performances here from both these actors and down the line definitely are going to receive um, nominations for best actor in in their respective categories um, the, s- the story starts off with our character Riley Flynn played by Zach Guilford who's involved in a car accident and he knocks down a young girl uh, and through drunk driving and he's going to serve a prison sentence we flash forward to the island where he's from uh, and we, we see his mom and dad, who are devout Christians, and his brother uh, in this remote island. Who is uh, The island is is decimated by an oil spill, so the fishing uh, industry has taken a nosedive. Um, Interfather Paul, a, ca- a, ca- a charismatic priest, played by uh, Hamish Linklater, he's replacing Monsignor Pruitt, who's away on the missions and has taken ill and is not returning. Uh, this, is, is, this, this show is really... Uh, it's a lot about faith and about religion and about people's uh, attitude to religion and their devotion to religion and some fanatical uh, devotion to religion. Uh, and, th- and different sides of religion are, 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 are here uh, with uh, the sheriff played by Rahul Kohli, who's uh, uh, Islam, is from uh, is the Islamic religion. Uh, but it's, it's fantastically done and it really is a twist. This is a good twist on a, fa- on, on, on a, on a horror genre that we've seen before but I like what Mike Flanagan has done here uh, things start to happen uh, in each episode and things are not quite what they seem as things prog- as things progress in it I'm not going to spoil it for you but there is standout performances here by all the actors especially as I said Hamish Linklater and Samantha Slow and the dialogue they get through here and the monologues they have to recite are fantastic we have a scene here with Kate Siegel and Zach Guilford uh, where Kate Siegel's character asks him what happens when we die, and he uh, produces a monologue here and uh, uh, an acting performance. Uh, I was riveted to it, and it ma- really makes you think about life and about religion. So hats off to Mike Flanagan here for the script, and Zach Gilford delivers a fantastic performance in that scene. Uh, the standout performances again. I mean, uh, Samantha Sloan here is chilling as Bev Keane. She really is. And she's definitely, definitely going to get an, uh, not an Oscar, sorry, a Golden Globe uh, nomination for a performance, as is Hamish Linklater for Father Paul. I really do believe they deserve it. Um, uh, as I said, it's it's a slow burn. Uh, it, if, you, if you're expecting The Haunting of Hill House and Bly Manor, this is not it. This is a slow burn. Uh, and, and it is a twist on, 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 a, on a formula uh, and that, that has been done for years in the horror genre. But it's a good twist on it, and I really enjoyed it. You're you're asking questions throughout the show, and what's going on here and uh, what's happening here. Uh, but you will enjoy it. It is worth your time. It's definitely, definitely worth your time, uh, simply because it looks fantastic. Uh, I mean, the color palette here it looks great. Uh, the production here is f- is top drawer. The script is top drawer, and the acting is top drawer. Uh, out of five stars, I would definitely give it four point five out of five. Uh, I really uh, I couldn't fault it it really is good and definitely worth your time so please slap a like on the video uh, and I'd like to hear your comments if you've seen it uh, what what did you think of it uh, and if you could subscribe to the channel McCord Movies I really would appreciate it uh, so that's it for me Midnight Mass on Netflix check it out uh, thanks for watching uh, and we'll talk soon take care